visit our buddy at Los Santos Customs and hopefully he could hook us up with some type of new horn. I'm sure it would be even pleasant for them too. They'd be like, oh, why am I going to pull that guy over? He's such a jolly guy. Today is going to be quite interesting. Unfortunately, in this shitty grim weather, my vehicle's horn decided to shit on itself. And every time I get in my vehicle, the horn wants to sound. So this is going to be very interesting because I'm going to go and see how long I can make it before getting pulled over, constantly honking the horn the whole episode. So that's going to be pretty interesting because one, I'm either going to snap and stab myself with a pencil while I'm recording this, or two, it's going to last 4.2 seconds because a cop's going to snap and want to stab himself with a pencil and then pull me over. So <laughs> that's pretty much how it's going to go. So I don't know. This is I'm like I'm using like a parking meter animation here, which is like it kind of worked. It really does. It honestly does. So as you guys obviously saw from the title, you know what we're doing. And uh, we're just going to fucking piss these motherfuckers off. I mean, I'm going to piss myself off in the recording process, too. Also doing some, uh, uh, you know, uh, rainy weather, which we don't ever do, to be honest. Uh, we never do that. Decided to switch it up. A little unconventional. We'll make it act like it's a uh, wiring issue or something. When it gets wet... Why did I do that? When it gets wet, um, the hood likes to screw around. We got a nice full tank of gas. As you can see, I'm obviously punching it myself. So this is going to be quite the interesting episode. Um, I'm ready to do it, though. So let's go right past the police station. Oh, man, this is going to be interesting. So like I said, unfortunately, when I drive and I'm in the vehicle, the horn just constantly sounds. There's nothing I can do about it. Fudo engineering is not that strong nowadays. And uh, basically, you know, back in the day, it was good. And then all of a sudden, we got to like 20 years later with this car. And every time it rains... It makes the horn go fucking nuts, and there's nothing I can do about it. Absolutely nothing I can do, but it's the only car I have. Don't mind my short shorts, too. This is probably like, I just realized that. Probably one of the worst outfits I could be uh, using right now, which is like a t-shirt and fucking short shorts. So this is going to be quite interesting. Do I have a horn button on my fucking... Which one is a horn button on the... Let me see if I can find the horn button really quick. I know it's one of them. Maybe it's not any of them. There's no such thing as a... Oh, there we go. It's E. I was going to see if I could do it. Yeah, it's probably easier for me to do it this way. So I'm going to use my finger here. There we go. I use a controller. So to drive around with a controller and have it be easy driving, it's kind of difficult. Especially when you're slamming down the fucking horn button. But we should be good here. If not, we can always switch back over. Okay, actually, I like it this way. That way I'm not... Damn, what the fuck was that truck doing? It just went through the whole map. So, like I said, we're going to try to drive down to lot. Holy Mini Cooper rally going on right there. I love how even in the daytime when it rains, it makes the uh, people put on their headlights. Okay, what in the oh, shit sticks? I haven't seen a fucking cop the whole time. Well, who's driving a Mini Cooper? Someone must be driving a Mini Cooper on the map because it's making them spawn pretty much every second. I can't wait till we pass a cop. I want them to... I wonder if they're gonna even be able to hear the horn. I wonder if it's like it'll glitch out and make it so it doesn't even sound like it's honking. If I'm not mistaken, it should stay active 24-7. So if I go around honking the horn pretty much the whole episode, um, you know, then it will. everyone will hear it. But I haven't seen a fucking cop in God knows how long, to be honest. I feel like I'm not even in a populated server right now. Oh no, they're in here. <laughs> Damn it. All right, well, we'll keep going then. I don't want to drive reckless or anything. I just want to, you know, keep it kind of civil. So that way it's more along the lines of me just trying to drive around with a fucked up horn than it is uh, <laughs> me driving reckless with a fucked up horn, which would be kind of ridiculous if I did that because it's like, hey, look at this dumbass who's clearly an idiot driving reckless and his horn is also going off. So it's kind of like an audible identifier on uh, kind of where the location's at of the criminal. So this is going to be interesting. Hopefully we'll get a cop here soon. I'm going to wrap back in. Oh, fuck both of these trucks, dude. That's a lot of trucks. I don't have time for all these trucks. I'm going to lower, I'm going to lower the gameplay for you guys. So that way it's not obsessive like amount of horns the whole time. Here we go. Here we go. I might get pulled over for that other shit I just did. Here we go. Nothing? 
I wonder if he doesn't hear it. I wonder if that might be the case. Like I said, with the whole glitching, you know, like we, we started the horn from so long ago that by the time we got to them, it doesn't even register. Here we go. I don't, okay. Yeah, buddy. Hold on. <laughs> this dude's probably like, what the fuck? What are going to get me for high beams? Because I have my high beams on. I'm just going to act natural. I have no weapon or anything on me. I'm not speeding. It's just, I unfortunately, when the weather's like this, God, my horn, it just, it's so bad. And there's nothing I can do about it. I feel horrible. I feel horrible because I don't have enough money to go buy another car. Oh, he's on me too. He's probably going to verify that the horn's still going. <laughs> this is great. I wonder if he thinks it's a sieve. I'm driving pretty goddamn good right now. I mean, to some extent. <laughs> oh, he's gonna get me. Oh, here's another one. Oh, fuck my my driving. Oh, 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 shit! It just turned on and off. Fuck, my thumb hurts so bad. It's like, dude, if you're gonna pull me over, pull me over. It's that way I don't have to hold this shit. Oh, dude, come on, my thumb, my poor thumb. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think about this episode before I started it. Oh god, this is like how to torture yourself 101. Oh, here we go, here we go. Alright, I gotta switch over to my finger now that I'm pulled over. Here we go. This sounds so bad, here we go. <laughs> I gotta switch over to my finger now that we're pulled over. Uh, it's unfortunate that it shows the animation of the horn going off. I wish it didn't. Um... That way it was a little more believable. Obviously, we'll have to roleplay here, so. And I can't shut it off till I turn the car off. So if he wants to come and chat with me, I can I can get out of the car really quick. Um, but I won't be able to do anything until uh, he gets out and talks to me. Can we lay off the horn? Can no, me, man, it's broke. I can turn it off. I can turn it off. I can turn the car off or something and step out, or I could just turn it off. So, so it's a broken problem, is it? Well, basically, whenever it rains, um, it, it it's something with the wiring, I think. The water gets in there, and then it just makes the horn go... Fu I, and I have no other car. I'm like, I, I don't have much money, so I can't just go buy another car. I can't figure it out. I don't know. Here, let me let me turn it off. Hold well, that's on. That's odd. Okay. Yeah, believe me, it's not a fun experience every time it rains, I'll tell you that. That must be annoying, honestly. Oh, um, it is. Yeah, it's a 20-year-old well, yeah, uh, car, my, so. My, I'm Deputy Cole. Yeah, Jesus. Well, um. <laughs> she says Jesus. I'm Deputy Cole, Los Santos Sheriff's Office. That's why I was pulling you over. Um, seems like you have a bigger problem than uh, than what was expected. Um. My best, my best advice is just uh, maybe try to get that looked out. I mean, I don't know. Maybe look I've at spent about $400 trying to figure out the fix. I'm, I have an appointment at Los Santos Customs in about an hour to go oh, see yeah. if they can rechange the horn out for another one. So we'll see uh, then, but I gotta I gotta wait till my appointment. Okay, gotcha. Um, <laughs> do you have a license registration proof of insurance on that vehicle for you? And then uh, if things great, I'm gonna let you go because I'm getting wet. All right, yeah, hold on, let me grab that. All right, my name is Ralph Longmore. Longmore, can you spell that? Is that common spelling? Yeah, uh, first name is R-A-L-P-H, uh, and then Longmore is common. Okay, gotcha. All right, just uh, hang tight, Ralph, and uh, I'll be right back with you. Okay. <laughs> so, it was for the horn, which isn't surprising, because if I heard that shit, I'd go, What the fuck are you doing? Like, <laughs> so, yeah, that is interesting. So, my whole gig that I'm going to do here is I'm going to... Get away with this. I'm going to drive around for a little bit longer, see if we can get a little more people weary of my horn. And we're going to head to Los Santos Customs, and we're going to change it out for something else. Um, and then I'm going to go around, and I'm going to drive again and be like, I'm sorry. Uh, I tried, and I changed it out for something else, and the problem still exists. So we'll probably pick, like, uh, for the last, like, one or two horns, if we do one or two more, uh, we'll probably pick, like, a musical 
uh, one. That would be kind of cool. They're probably going to think it's like me just being a prick going around driving and fucking blasting the music. But that's definitely not the case. Let's see what he has to say here. Oh, I thought that was a baton. I was like, what did I do? Hopefully it doesn't come back stolen or anything. I mean, I thought I set up my character right. I like how it looked like he was looking behind him. That's great. At least I'm not wasting gas either. I'm glad how he, he makes a statement about, um... Oh, fuck. Please don't have a warrant. Okie dokie, Ralph. Alright, uh, here's goes your information. Um, everything looks to be clear. Okay, uh, good. My best guess is, uh, try to get that checked out as soon as possible, because, uh... I do believe my other officers here will pull you over. <laughs> oh, I wouldn't be surprised. I just am trying to make it with what I got. Yeah, you know how that goes. Yep. Alright, sir. Well, uh, as soon as... As soon as I, uh, get back to my vehicle, you're, uh, actually free to go, sir. All right, I appreciate it. Have a good one. Yeah, no problem. You too, sir. Stay safe. Thank you. All right, let's just engine on. Yeah, are you all good, Hunter? <laughs> okay, then we'll take off this way with the horn going. So again, like I told him, I have a appointment at Los Santos. Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh. Oh, someone just blew the fuck up down there. I saw the initial explosion, then heard it. Okay, I don't think he turned around on me, so we're good. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, we're going to go down to the highway. And then we're going to head down to Los Santos Customs. Don't mind this blown up carcass of a vehicle right here. What the fuck, dude? Why is this even a thing? That's sketch. This is so sketchy, dude. Yeah, I'm interested to see what they're going to say about the musical one, because obviously I've made it known to a few officers that this problem is going on. So I'm hoping that if I can make it known to a few more, that they're going to, you know, kind of get the picture here that uh, clearly there's something very wrong with my vehicle. It probably should not be on the roadway. I look like a blown up police car, but it wasn't. Are you going to turn? No. Yep, you are. Some bitch. Yeah, let's get to this freeway. This is quite interesting. I don't- I- at first I was gonna do this idea with just the horn going off, and there was like no real reason, uh... I got ooh, gotta get my finger a rest. There was like no real reason for me to do it, and then I was like, wait, let's add rain and we'll have a wire problem. I think that excuse right there is what helped me actually get through that without having any fucking issues. Because, my God, that would not have worked any other way. What excuse would I have used? I don't know. There's two wires touching each other that are making the fucking horn go bananas right now. That would have sounded like retardation. Again, speeding when you have a horn going off, probably not the best idea. Because not only what do they might have a radar going, but as you pass, it's just going to be this ridiculous horn. It's like, hey, me, me, I was the one doing it. Oh, my God. Yeah, I'm glad everything came back clear. When that second officer pulled up, I got a little scared, but... Seemed to be as if everything was okay. No need to worry. People are acting like I'm honking at them. That's not it. I'm not doing that, man. I'm just... What are they doing? Is that a person? I gotta see if that's a person. It's not a person. What the fuck made them pull off to the side of the road like that? That was very weird. Holy shit. Alright, we'll switch back over to the thumb. I gotta give it breaks, dude. My fingers are hurting trying to do this shit. The very tedious fucking shit. Alright, here we go. We'll hit up uh, Panorama here. This is um, our US-68 that leads to Panorama. It's a pretty heavy area when it comes to enforcement. So I'm hoping we'll be able to snag a few more going into Sandy Shorts. Don't cut me off. That horn saved me. I think he was like, oh no, I'll go around. Dude's already pre-blaring his horn. Alright, yeah. So far, so good. One pull over. Uh, one other sheriff SUV saw me, but I think that's the secondary that pulled up to the scene uh, when I was taken off. So, I could try my best to get a little more. Where are you at, cops? Why is there so many trucks on the map? I've never seen this many trucks on the map before. Like, actually deep in s sandy shores and stuff. <laughs> Here's an explorer. I haven't seen him before. Okay, this is going to be good. Or maybe that was the one that pulled me over. Yeah, that could have been the one that pulled me over. 
Unless I don't even remember what pulled me over. We're gonna go this way and head down to Harmony. That's way I can get my horn fixed and maybe we can pass up another cop on the way. If not, this is just, this is, my finger is gonna regret this tomorrow. I swear to God. Most fucking painful shit slamming down the horn button. That would be cool if it was like underneath the controller, like where your index finger and middle finger kind of lay with like a soft button instead of this shit. This is ridiculous. All right, over to the index because this ain't working. Okay, there we go. We got a nice straight road. I've held my horn down for like two or three minutes in real life before on someone. So this is definitely not the most unrealistic thing, but probably an obnoxious episode to say the least. But hey, if this is what happens, this is what happens. That's why we gotta roleplay it out sometimes. We gotta give them the good stuff. Oh, almost couldn't stop because of the fucking rain. Holy shit, that could have been a lot more deadly than it had to be. So yeah, we're gonna go visit our buddy at Los Santos Customs and hopefully he could hook us up with some type of new horn. We'll have to go through the uh, options he has. That looked like a cop, but it wasn't. They were smashing too for a second. Yeah, I'm not sure if we're going to see any down over here. Uh, since that, I'm just going to go ahead and pass this fucker up. Because, ooh, that might be a cop. Nope, that's a minivan. Not unless the minivan adopted police. Look, or the, yeah, there it is. Unless the police adopted minivans lately. All right, I'm going to go ahead and just refresh the horn. That way they have a chance of hearing it in case they are in harmony. Oh, we got one here. Ooh, hit the brakes, bud. Hit the brakes. Here we go. Oh, he's walking back to his car. <laughs> oh, what are you doing, you fuck? What do you- why is it opening that? That's so weird. I've never seen it open that before. Alright, obviously he didn't want nothing to do with me. He just wants to stand in the rain and get ridiculously wet. All these minivan looks like cop cars for some reason. I have no idea why. All right, so we're gonna hit up Los Santos Customs. We're gonna talk to our uh, good friend there, who's no one. And we're gonna get our horn tricked out for something a little better, a little more appealing, unless they're not hearing it. That could be the case. Try to get there. Yeah, not many fucking officers out here, which that's okay with me. All right, let's just pull through the fucking... Hey man, I need some help. I'm gonna turn my car off so that way I don't annoy myself in here. There we go. All right, I need so I need a few horns. Can you show me what you got? All right, let's see what we got here. Let's go to mod menu. Vehicle, vehicle mod menu. That rain looks so good out there. Okay, uh, horns. We got a truck horn. Let's get to the musical horns. <clears throat> All right, that's not... We gotta find something good. Like, I want something that hasn't been used 362 million times in uh, GTA Online. There was some that I heard earlier that sounded pretty awesome. Let's see, Jazz Horn? Nope. Nope. Star Spangled Banner? No, that's been overused like 6 million times. I want something that's good. These might be good. These sound actually really good. I haven't heard these that much. Oh, yeah. That's a really long one, too. Holy shit. That's been overused. Liberty City Loop. There it is. That's not bad. <laughs> that's like Christmas. Do, 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 do. Yep, we're over there making our own little fucking jingle fucking express. Oh wow, they got... I am surprised that they added that many, okay. Um, one of the Halloween loops is probably where it's at. I think that would be kind of cool. Or... I like that one. That one's pretty sick. So I think that'll be a good upgrade. Let me just go ahead and give my hand a little workout because this is ridiculous. My fucking... It's... It hurts. It's bad. It is really bad. Alright, let's go ahead and get this shit popping like the 4th of July, even though... Oh, here we go. 
He's giving him a parking ticket. <laughs> this one's so much better. Oh my god. That's pleasant to listen to. I'm sure it would be even pleasant for them too. They'd be like, why am I gonna pull that guy over? He's such a jolly guy going around playing music for all the people on the streets. That's great. I want to see cops now. I want to get that reaction. I want to hear what they have to say over something different. I'm going to switch it over to something else because thumb's really hurting with how uh, much I have to press down on that thumbstick for it. All right, there we go. We should be able to comfortably drive now, even though it looks super jank if you were to actually see me doing this. There we go. We got this. Been driving in this game for way too long. Quick stops. Well, we got some uh, cops of the yellow jack. <laughs> this is so good. I'm glad we picked this one. <laughs> it looks like my blinker's just been on for god. Oh no, my hazards are on. I should probably keep them on. That would look good. That way it adds a little more flash and it's like, I'm trying to stay safe, man. I gotta get gas. Yeah, we're gonna go get gas. I'm gonna restart it again, too. That way I want them to be able to hear it, too. I don't want it to cut out. Unless they've, like, put it out on the radio. No, 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 he's good, don't worry. There's no need to pull him over. It's just an issue that happens with his rain and, and the wiring, like, what the fuck? That would not be legit. I really like this one. Gotta slam on the brakes. I like how it's like super slow. I wonder if it gets faster as you go. That might be the case. Okay, there we go. We'll uh, go ahead and shut the vehicle off. That way there's no horn. We can get everything set up. And then we'll be right back on the road to see who else we can fucking annoy to death. We're back on the road. I got the horn going, the car on. One of those SUVs over there again. He has to hear that shit. <laughs> this is so good. He's gonna, oh, he turned around, dude. He turned around. He turned around. I think it's going to the speed of my fucking car. I really think it is. Here we go. <laughs> oh, he has to. Yep. I knew it. Oh, interaction. No, he didn't. Or did he? I don't know. He's confusing even my life. I don't know. Oh, yeah. He might be coming. And I think there was another cop that turned down here. Let me just not break. I'm going to just keep a steady 45. This is fucking great, dude. I'm going to just have to go back and say, it didn't work, man. This is so good. I wonder if he hears it still. Oh my god, this could- you couldn't ask for anything better. Yeah, he's right, he's- Oh! <laughs> what a prick! I sound like a really bad ice cream truck. Like, what the fuck, bro? Hey man, you see that? He hit my car! I'm gonna just get out of the car, turn it off. Oh no, man. You alright? I mean, I'm alright, but that motherfucker was on the wrong side of the road over there. Yeah, I saw that, man. The, uh, the drivers here ain't, you know, exactly the most intelligent. Yeah, well, that's fucked up. It was raining and my car's already broke. Now I have a broken headlight. See that shit? <laughs> yeah, I do. I see, I see that. Uh, do you see which way that vehicle went? He went, I would assume, back to Sandy. He was doing a fucking U-turn or something. He went in the dirt and then came out and popped out of nowhere. Yeah, uh, could, could you tell me what vehicle it was? I was kind of it was, looking at my computer for It was a, a minivan. It was a minivan with a broken windshield. I don't, I don't know. 
something like that. Maybe like brown or something. I think he was saying he was looking at his laptop even though he was totally fucking looking. No, no, I'm good. All right, do you think you could uh, take this vehicle home or do you think it needs to be towed? Oh no, it's drivable. It's just, you know, I'm trying to get my horn fixed and we just went and tried to get it fixed, but I yeah, guess what our fix did didn't work, so we're gonna have to try something else. Yeah, I heard that horn around Sandy. Uh, what's going on with that? Oh, basically when the weather gets bad and the water gets in there, some water gets on the wiring and it makes it go bananas. You know, I actually had an old, uh, an old Jetta that said that when it rained, the windows would roll themselves down and the horn would honk itself. Yep. Exactly, it's not good. Well, yeah. What all I've right, been dealing well, with. Uh, well, if you say you're alright and, um, you know, your vehicle seems to be able to be driven. Uh, you say you're going down there to the Los Angeles Customs or what have you? Yeah, I was just down there not too long ago. But, I'm um, probably going to try to... Right, well, you told me to follow you there or you got it? No, I should be good. I'm going to drive it around a little longer and see if I can get it to uh, shut off or whatnot. We just put a new horn in, so... Alright, cool. Sounds like a plan. Well, I'm going to go ahead and put a bolo out for that minivan and we'll let you know, alright? Um, before I let you go, can I get some contact information? Uh, what's your name, sir? Yeah, my name is um, Ralph Longmore. I mean, if you don't want to give it to me, that's fine. Oh, you didn't hear me say it? I said Ralph Longmore. Ralph Longmore. All right, cool. Uh, I'll let you know if it's It even there. activated right. that it good said. Your car. All right, I appreciate it. Have a good one. You too. They were good here. <laughs> yeah. Well, thanks for showing up. Though. He didn't even act like... Uh, <laughs> he didn't even act like I, I said anything because I guess it didn't register, so... <laughs> he was like, if you don't want to tell me, that's fine. I was like, dude, I told you. What are you talking about? All right, let me... Oh, I forgot the horn. Shit. Oh, he's coming down this way, though. All right, we're going to have one more chance to see if we can piss these fuckers off. And I'm going to go past the Los Santos Customs and see if this guy in the uh, Explorer bites. He's not too close, but I'm pretty sure he hears that shit. I mean, it's... You cannot not hear that, that's for sure. Ooh, don't fear, don't fear, don't fear. I don't want to get pulled over for a DUI or something. Oh, there's another one at the gas station. There's so many cops, I love it. Or maybe that's not a cop, that's a civilian. That might be a civilian. Yeah, it's civilian. <laughs> that's a nice ass car, I like that. Oh my god, I'm trying to look behind me and it's not working good. Fuck, I'm gonna have to pull off up here or something. There we go. I gotta switch too, because my thumb's starting to hurt again. <laughs> That's a problem with this. This whole fucking episode has been like, Hey, if you really want to hurt yourself, this is how you do it. For 40 minutes fucking straight, like, shit. Oh, that, that guy is riding his ass, bro. Holy shit. Here we go, we're passing another one. 24-7 is now open for roleplay at Clinton Avenue, Los Santos. I'm gonna go to the uh, gas station up here. <laughs> here we go. He didn't want to do anything. I think he did. Did he pull in here? Where'd he go? Did he just keep going straight? He might have pulled in the gap. Oh, I think he told, uh, might have pulled next to his buddy down there. I'm not sure. Well, that is interesting. So I guess they don't trip that bad. I guess if you give them a legitimate, a legitimate enough reason to be out there on the road with your horn blaring the whole time, they're cool with it, which I guess that's respectful. I mean, if I'm not out there purposely doing this shit, I don't think there's a reason to go like, dude, you got to fucking knock it off with your horn. And I'm glad they respect the fact that if someone goes, hey, I'm not really... I don't have that much money to go out and get a new vehicle. They're like, yeah, that's fine. Just try to get it fixed. So that's that's cool. Because <clears throat> that shit would be obnoxious as fuck. Also, drivers could take that shit as a uh, sign of aggression. So it would probably not help a situation at all. That's one of the cops that was down there, I think. Oh, yeah, he's still... They were talking to each other. Okay, here we go. I'm going to try one more time past him. Oh, shit. He popped back around. Oh, here we go. 
Oh, I think one of them's down there too. Here we go. Oh, fuck. They're waiting. That's so cool. Oh, he's going around. I'm going to try to get to the Los Santos Customs and just say, yeah, I wanted to get a drink before I went to Los Santos Customs because I know they're going to work on my vehicle for a while. So, oh, please get there. Please get there. Oh, fuck, dude. There's so many BCSOs. Here we go. Almost there. Please get there. Please. So tempting. So cl Oh, fuck. I'm gonna just pull on the fucking thing. I'm gonna turn my car off. There we go. Oh, vehicle is off now. <laughs> God damn. I guess when you if you keep doing it, you're gonna just keep getting pulled and pulled over more, but we did end up at Los Santos Customs. So it's not like we Oh, you know what this might be for? Is the headlight. It might actually be for the headlight, not even the horn. Even though I'd be an idiot if I say it's not the horn, because it has to be. Ooh, it's starting to get nighttime. That's the Yeah, so this is gonna be interesting. How are we gonna explain this one? Throw it in a little bit of a... Well, actually, I'm gonna use the same excuse. Why would I change it? What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna use the same excuse, and uh, I'm pretty sure we'll be able to get away with this because, I mean, if you haven't been able to notice, we are literally right. I could probably just drive in there and just be like, yeah, man, I mean, I was driving to the Los Santos Customs, so it's not like I was running or anything. Just pull like 10 feet ahead, and then boom, I'm there. I mean, I've been, I've been pulled over, what, like two or three times? So, I know I'll be good. And I'm sure that other guy got back in his car and ran my name. <laughs> so. Alright, let's see what we got going on here. You're really gonna stand in the rain, dude? I wouldn't do that shit. I'd get everything I need before I leave that vehicle done and then come and talk to him. Okay, I keep thinking they're coming out with a baton or something, but they're not. What are you doing? <laughs> Evening, sir. What's up? I do believe I possibly recognize you the the horn, correct? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, now you got a now you got a melody to it. <laughs> well, we had him switch it out. Remember what I said we were going to switch it out and that was our idea is try to put a whole new horn in and I didn't want to if it did come back, I didn't want to listen to the same thing over and over, so I decided to put a melody in. Yeah. I mean, it makes it also, softer uh, instead of someone thinking that I'm honking at him the whole time. Well, yeah, yeah, very true, very true. Um, I'm also pulling you over for your uh, right headlights. Uh, it's busted out. Yeah, that was because of. Uh, I saw you back there on US Route 60. Well, yeah, it was a, it was an accident. Some car pulled out in front of me with, and then uh, one of your other troopers was there in a SUV, and he pulled me over, made sure I was okay. So there's, it literally happened about 20 minutes ago with someone else because of the rain. Oh, okay. Well. Did he call hmm. in a backup unit? At this point, well, he might okay, have. actually, I can see that you're pulling into the auto repair shop. Are you going to try to uh, fix that again? Yeah, we were going to have another chat and see if there would be any other type of fusing we can do for the wires or whatnot. Okay, gotcha. Hang on a second. One second, sir. All right. <laughs> I'm just breaking their mind right now. They don't know what to do. Oh my god, that fucking Explorer looks sexy though. Same with that Charger. Love it. Absolutely love it. Uh, yeah, they went far enough to where I can't fucking hear them. That sucks. <laughs> like, damn it. I wish I could hear what they were saying. Well, hopefully everything's good. I'm pretty sure it's going to be another warning. If not, it might be a fix-it ticket. I don't think he would give me a ticket. Maybe, maybe. I don't know. I don't think so. Because I've been very cooperative with everyone the whole episode, so it's not like I've been like, Fuck you, leave me alone because of my horn. So, I don't think it'll get to that level. Oh, now they're sucking each other back there. Just knocked his hat off and shit. Oh my god. god. I wish that shit was not a thing. I really wish it was not a thing in GTA. It is the most stupidest fucking thing there is. Yeah, I have no idea what's going to go on here. I, I truly don't. I mean, this is like, what a better spot I could be at is literally right in front of the auto repairs fucking sign. So, you can't say I wasn't trying. 
And he already knows that, so that's a good thing. Alright, moment of truth. Dun dun dun. Alrighty, sir. I already have your uh, information locked up in, uh, in the system, so I don't need to run you again. Um, what I'm going to be doing now... I'm going to be writing you a written warning so uh, none of these uh, officers try it. to pull you over again. Um, I'm going to be writing down in here that you uh, visited an auto repair shop once and you are going to visit them again for the uh, second time. And that you've had a collision within the past 24 hours that allows you to get by with that busted headlight, okay? Alright, I appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. Uh, it seems like uh, your problems get would be annoying after a while, so uh, I'm just going to cut you a break. They're soaking wet. Yeah, I appreciate it. Thanks for getting wet, too. That sounds really sexual. <laughs> yeah, no problem. <laughs> That's what we do. So, yeah, uh, all on the job, sir. Anyways, yep. so I'm going to let you say again. All on the job, he said. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. All right, so <laughs> say I'm again? You, uh, be on Talk him way. in the face again. again. So uh, take it easy and have a safe night, sir. All right, I appreciate it. You too. Yes, sir. Get me in this car. I'm wet. <laughs> and here we go. Back into the garage. Even though this is a paint booth, what am I doing? There we go. Alright, we'll turn it off. Very nice. Try to get cracking on doing some work on this bad boy, but as you can see, he gave me a written warning, which means it's going to void other cops pulling me over and uh, the headlight it's going to be fixed by los santos customs as well but he also gave me a uh fix it ticket and or warning for that as well too so it's going to stop cops from pulling me over which means that me going around and doing this anymore wouldn't make any sense because no one's going to want to pull me over for the next 24 hours which is actually very nice that they did that so that way i had a chance to uh get it fixed so, that is an awesome episode. Uh, we probably annoyed the shit out of about 95% of the cops, and I probably annoyed the shit out of, well, I know I annoyed the shit out of myself. So, thank you guys for sticking around for another episode of DOJ. We will see you next episode. <laughs>